Hello everybody and welcome back to Simon Says, this is some well playing uh, Rogue Legacy and I think I'm going to do this for a little while. Um, now I imagine that some of the people who watched my Dungeons of Dreadmore series know that I was a little bit scummy and didn't use permadeath, but I, um, we're going to do something a little bit different that's sort of not quite in the same vein. Let's start my legacy. So I am this little guy, and and basically, oh look, it's Santa! You know, <laughs> can't kill Santa. So basically, I've watched the one video of this, and the idea is that I have to complete these four areas here. The castle, the dungeon, the forest, and the tower. Um, and I do that by um, defeating bosses and stuff. Just have to be kind of careful here because I do not have a lot of health. Now from what I've read, I'm actually not supposed to to finish this on my first go. So we're just gonna have to see how much money we get on this uh, first run and we'll see how it, uh, how it goes. Be careful. Hm. That's close. Alright, so I have 63 health points apparently, and I have some magical ability apparently? Oh, okay. I can shoot knives at things. Guess I have to... <laughs> Alright, what do we get here? We get a blueprint apparently. Ah, yeah, I messed up a little bit. As always, uh, well, actually, no, not as always. For the first time in a little while, uh, my sister Isabel is here. Because, well, she's Isabel, and that's about it, really. get those things yet. Actually there are a lot of things that I can't really get so I'm gonna need to be really careful. Ah. Oh and that's my first life. Damn. And uh, that's the end of the game. No, it's not. As you can see, I have I, my title screen now says "Choose your heir," and that is basically how this game goes. So now we get to choose what sort of player we can be, and also they have um, different traits as well. Let's see, we can be a barbarian. And apparently, with the trait Aidman, which apparently means you remember things with extreme clarity. Hey, did you want to say something? What did you want to say? <sighs> and then, this guy has no traits, but he is a knight and apparently has a conflux spell or something. This one is just a knight, but frozen axe. I'm gonna go with the barbarian here and see how this goes. Oh! Here's something, apparently with each life we get to purchase and upgrade things, so let's up purchase the smithy. So we got a blue print for him earlier. And let's upgrade some uh, health a little bit. Let's upgrade. Ooh, let's upgrade our knight. 
Excellent. And uh, can we do anything else? No. Alright, so let's talk to this guy first. Welcome, hero. Maybe you can help me. I used to be the, the greatest blacksmith in all the lands, but one day the monsters of this castle attacked my smithy and stole all my blueprints. Without them, I can only make cutlery and stuff. Please bring back any blueprint you find and I can build the most amazing equipment ever. At a price, of course. So, we... we what did we get? We gave him... What was the thing that we found before? It was... I think it was... That? But yeah, we can't really... Purchase any of it. So sadly, we're just going to have to leave him be for now. And here's the other thing, is to enter the castle again, one must pay the toll. And toll is basically all my money. So with each, with each uh, quote unquote life, we uh, start again. But I don't think I can go in, yeah I can't go in here because I don't have all the things. So, alright, let's uh, head downward, I guess, and let's see where this takes us. Oop. So, I have a little bit more health this time around, which is good, but I'm going to need to be careful. Obviously, I wasn't being very careful there, what? What would you say? Level 3. Oh, yeah, I am. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm not doing very well this life. Alright, well, I killed that guy. Um, don't have a lot of health. Uh, I can earn a little bit more. Careful. Okay, I got him. And let's head. Oh. I don't think I'm gonna go that way. It might reward me a lot, but I don't think it will. Alright, I'm gonna wait for the skeleton to throw another bone. Because, seeing as he just did that. Yep, there you go. Okay, that was close. Up oh, okay, I can see where the extreme clarity comes in. In my mini-map on the top right, you can kind of see all of the, uh, the enemies that I know of. Alright, so let's... Ooh! Excellent. Yep, we've got a lot more money this time because of that guy. Oh no! Well. Okay, I guess I'm going to do one more life and then I'm going to end this first episode. Now, my choices change again. So let's see. Lady Priscilla is a mage. Is gay and apparently has electrophobia. Chickens freak you out. Um, Sir Gans is a knave, a risky hero, low stats but can land devastating critical strikes. And this is also gay. Uh, barbarian, gigantism, and actually, yeah, I think I'll take this guy. Alright, now then, with our money, what can we do? We can upgrade. Our health again? Um, and we can equip. We can upgrade our equipment. So, alright, so architect or enchantress. Um, I think I'm gonna improve my health actually, because that would probably be a good idea. Which of course means I still can't really buy anything from our blacksmith here. But 
Maybe, maybe uh, in the next episode. All right. So this first room is always the same, I'm pretty sure. And I just remember that I can actually break this stuff, I think. I'm not sure if it actually gives me anything, no. Oh, jeez. All right. What a horrible introductory room. Oh. All right. We need to be careful then. Ah, Jesus. <laughs> this is not, this is not good. <sighs> what a start. Alright, I think I'm gonna try and... Take care of that guy. That kind of came at a price. On the other hand, oh, look. Oh no, wow, that. That, uh. That didn't go very well at all. Don't, don't sit on my heater. You can't really even do that. It's. Like, it's not made to be sat on. Ugh. <laughs> Anyway, so, um, that's, that was my, um, first free, uh, heroes, I suppose. <laughs> Next time, we're gonna, uh, try and, um, we're gonna try this again. And, uh, see how better we fare then, or something. <laughs> I will see you guys, uh, next time. Do you want to say something? Yeah.